Today I'm going to show you how to find a list of missing work for a particular student. So once you're in Power School, you can either go to Power Teacher Pro in a specific class here, or you can navigate to it over here on the left hand side. I'm going to go into uh, my study hall class just as a demo. So I clicked on Power Teacher Pro. I've waited for my class to load. I went ahead, I have two assignments that I put in and I know that I marked one of them. I think that's one, let's see. As a missing assignment. When I entered the score, I marked it with the missing exclamation point so that it would be easy to keep track of any students that are missing any work. So now to print a report for the student, I'm gonna to go to the left-hand side, click on reports. Individual student report at the top. And then this is where you need to change your settings um, if they don't default to these. So if I wanted to select multiple classes, I could. For this purpose, I'm just picking the one class that I have assignment set up for at the moment. The sort options are pretty standard by student by last name. Um, the newest first, you can change that if you'd like to. Areas to include. So here, all I need selected is assignments if all I'm trying to show are my late assignments or missing assignments. What's really important here is that you set the date range. So right now we're in third quarter, so I wanna make sure that I choose third quarter. If it's a different reporting period, you just wanna select whatever quarter or semester, depending how you're grading uh, that the assignment's for. And then to filter assignments, I am just looking for the assignments that I marked as missing. So I'm gonna click on missing, and then I can run my report. I'm running it for two students right now. I'm selecting the whole class this way. So I can find my report here. Give it a second to load. And here's my report. Uh, one student has no missing assignments. My second one has one missing assignment at the moment for this demonstration. The other setting that you can change if you're looking for a specific student, if you scroll back up to the top, you have a tab to be able to choose students. So if you would rather choose individual students, you can click here to add or remove students. If you know you're looking for a specific student, you can just select that one student and then you would run the report. Hopefully that helps in learning how to print a list of missing assignments for one student. Uh, thanks for watching. Have a great day.